My name is Monika Zagrobelna and this is how to make a Photoshop action to create a portrait photo effect on Envato Touch Plus. Photoshop actions allow you to add special photo effects to your pictures with a single click. You can create unique portraits by applying Photoshop filters and effects. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to create such a photo effect for a portrait in the form of a Photoshop action. We're going to turn a photo into a ballpoint pen drawing. And because it's an action, you'll be able to use the same effect for other photos later. Open your photo. It should be about 2,500 pixels wide. Create a new layer and name it Mask. Use a soft brush to paint the area that you want to be modified by the action. In portrait actions like this, we usually want to select the person to cut it from the background. Make sure that the first layer is called Background. If not, go to Layer, New, Background from Layer. Open the Actions panel and click the white card icon to create a new action. Give it some name and click Record. The action is being recorded now, but there's no hurry. Only your actions are being recorded, not the time between them. Hold Ctrl key and click the thumbnail of the mask layer to set the selection. Then go to the background layer and use the shortcut Ctrl J to copy the selected part. Go back to the background layer and create a new layer. Go to Edit, Fill and fill it with white. Hide the mask layer. Go to layer 1 and duplicate it with Ctrl J. Add a black and white adjustment layer to remove the colors. Add an exposure adjustment layer. Change the exposure and offset to make the photo brighter and less contrasting. This will fit the style of a drawing better. Select the layer with its adjustments, then right-click and select Merge Layers. Duplicate the copied layer and hide the new copy. Select Layer Exposure 1 and go to Filter, Filter Gallery. Go to the Sketch tab and select the Graphic Pen. Drag the sliders to maximum and select Right Diagonal for the direction. Click OK. Show the copy, select it, and go to Filter Gallery again. Use the same settings, except this time use Horizontal for the direction. Add a new layer mask to the layer. With the mask selected, go to Filter, Render, Clouds. This mask will add the strokes of a different direction in random areas, making the effect more natural. Show layer 1 again and move it to the top. Go to Filter, Blur, Smart Blur. Change the mode to Edge Only, Quality to High, and adjust the settings to create some sharp outlines without too many details. Go to Image, Adjustments, Invert. Change the Blend mode to Multiply. Add a Hue Saturation layer. Check Colorize and change the color to something resembling a blue pen. Create a new layer and fill it with any color. Double-click it and fill it with a button that looks like a sheet of a notebook. Adjust the scale. Right-click the layer and select Rasterize Layer Style. Then change the Blend Mode to Multiply. Add a Hue Saturation layer. Clip it to the layer below, then change the color of the grid to something more subtle. Finally, click Stop Recording to save the action. The action is now ready to be used for any other photo with a single click. Just remember to use a similar size to keep the effect as you planned it. But this is a very simple photo effect. Photoshop offers much more. If you want to save time, you can use actions created by other people on Envato Elements. For example, this action creates a nice soft focus in studio lights. The effect is eye-catching, magical, and gives unique results in every photo. This action adds a snow effect to your photo. It's subtle, very realistic, and can be used for a variety of photos, not only for portraits. It doesn't only add snow, but also creates special color effects for pictures. This is a whole set of actions, each creating a unique retro effect. Your photo is converted to black and white, and a special texture is added to give an impression of an old photo.
Each action works like an advanced Photoshop filter. Duo tones are very trendy and this set contains 66 actions that will help you achieve such an effect in any colors you wish. After the action is applied, you can still customize it or combine it with other photo effects. Now you know how to create a Photoshop action with photo effects and how to use actions to create eye-catching portraits. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and thanks for watching.